I'm going to run you through some of the big wins of tonight, but let's just look at where we're standing right now. The Ontario PCs, 83 seats. They won 76 in the last election, so they've gained some ground here. NDP with 31 seats. Liberals with just eight seats. And, of course, Mike Schreiner won his riding, so Green Party with that one seat. We're going to start with the riding that everybody was watching tonight. That is Vaughn Woodbridge, where Stephen Del Duca, Liberal leader, was running. He lost that riding to uh, the PCs, Michael Tobolo winning that riding, the incumbent. We're going to move over to Brampton now, where the uh, PCs have basically swept Brampton, including Brampton Centre. And uh, Singh, for the NDP, has uh, the, the deputy leader of the NDP, has lost that riding to the PCs. The PCs also sweeping Mississauga, including Mississauga Lakeshore. Rudy Cosetto has won that riding. Now we're going to uh, move over to uh, another star candidate, Michael Ford. He has won the riding of York Southwest, and that has never been held by a conservative. And now Michael Ford has it. Of course, uh, Michael Ford, the nephew of Doug Ford. Hamilton East, Stony Creek. Neil Lumsden, star candidate again. He has won this riding. He is a um, Canadian Football Hall of Famer. So that's where that went. But it's not all good news for the PCs because another star candidate, Mark Saunders, who is the former police chief, has lost uh, the riding of Don Valley West to the Liberals. And we're also going to uh, show you Toronto Centre, where Kristen Wong Tam won that riding. Another star candidate. She, former city councillor, um, stepped away from city council to uh, run for the NDPs and has won Toronto Centre. Interesting one I want to end off with is Haldeman Norfolk because at the bottom of your screen you'll see one going to other. That is uh, to independent Bobby and Brady and what happened here was the incumbent conservative um, wasn't running in this election. Bobby Ann was the former executive assistant. She ran. She won it. So that's how it stood. This is City News Everywhere.